Hello, welcome, welcome, and I'm going to be doing a gameplay today of, yeah, you read the title correctly, this is Golden Axe Revenge of Death Adder on the arcade, this is going to be a full playthrough, uh, a game I've wanted to be playing through on my channel for such a long time, I think Golden Axe is one of the greatest games, the original Golden Axe, one of my favourite arcade games, um, beat em ups, and I wanted to, like I said, do a, a playthrough of this version for such a long time. Uh, so I finally found the time to do it and what I'm going to do is I'm going to actually play through uh, hopefully all of it but as far as I can certainly with each of the characters uh, just to get a good view of how each one plays. Uh, this game has great little branching paths, it's a great update from the original. Uh, it's got those classic sound effects that were in the original with a load of tweaks gameplay wise so yeah let's get it cracking and uh, see what we can do. Stick in a few credits. So we'll start with this guy. Go. Lovely animation, great music. Starts epic music as soon as you start. And what's good with this is that when you hit the characters, when you hit the enemies, the screen, well, not the screen, but you can see a slight shake to confirm like you've actually hit them. So there's a good like feeling of actually when you hit the enemies on this, that you're really dealing some damage. Nice little jumping attacks on this as well. You can do like a, a diving kick here. Very Ninja Turtle style. <laughs> uh, and you know, I don't... I mean, you can ride on the enemies and various beasts in this is in this game, very Golden Axe style. But I, I do tend to like to just walk on the ground. I think the dragons in the original Golden Axe were just awesome. The fire-breathing dragons. They were definitely one of the best enemies to ride on. Absolutely. the magic potions and that's that's another thing in this game that's made had a really lovely overhaul is the magic potion system because where in the original golden axe you can use your magic once and what they'll do when you collect your when you collect your magic potions you just can use your magic once but on this you can use it multiple times until it's all gone which is great volume just a little bit it's a little bit low get some really good effect there there we go let's continue let's get some energy off this guy run, double hit forward and you can do a run which is great. All the typical Golden Axe button commands are here. get to free the slaves or the captured people undo their chains 
let's use some magic here. Oh, that's so satisfying. Great effects. I always love the magic effects in Golden Axe. Really sets it off from any other beat em up. These guys are always quite tricky to get, aren't they? Oh, I have to pull something over there. What is that? The tent. Oh, right, okay. <laughs> Oh, this guy's got the electrocution scorpion. We're gonna continue. And we're gonna use the next girl. The pugil stick. really see the difference in the increase in sprites on this game. I mean, they made them so much bigger. I think this is essentially, this is like a 32-bit game. It's definitely running on much more powerful hardware. You can definitely tell that. Look at that, yeah. Definitely. Definitely improvement graphically, isn't it? Next town, scene two. So this is the branching paths. I'm gonna go this way actually, because I've actually been through that tunnel before. Um, so we're gonna go this way actually, through the forest. Oh, these guys are in the cave as well, actually, okay. Let's try and get to the right side of these guys. Oh, I love how the trees just explode. Very nice. So these guys will essentially take the places of like the skeletons that were in the original Golden Axe who were like the most annoying enemies in the game. The skeletons were quite difficult, weren't they? I love the way they just explode here. Oh, these guys again. Very medieval. Love the effects. Get some magic prepared soon. Use my magic. See what we should can do magic wise. Alright, let's get some magic going now. Oh, she's got the lightning, very nice. I love that over the original that you can use your magic multiple times instead of just once. They really needed to change that in Golden Axe. So collect all those magic bottles and just be only able to use it once was quite disappointing. So that's interesting, she turns into a regular girl when she's riding a an enemy, which is good. 
Oh, I need you. Oh, okay, never mind. Some health would have been good. Oh, trees growing. problem here, right? There we go. Is that food? Can I pick that up? Yes. I have to do a jump here, right? doing a lot better with her than I am with the original guy Stern. Oh, been captured. That's not good. Oh, time to use some magic for sure. They caught the wrong girl. that lads and we're free let's free these guys can I free those guys over there yeah I can excellent Guys with the fire, they need to go. Is it boss? Oh no, the skeletons are here. Here they are. But we're going to continue with. Big boy. Nice. Okay, what's this now? Bonus stage? Catch the chicken? Oh, slice up the chicken. Interesting. Sing the enemy's town, we renewed our ouch to save the villagers. I think that's supposed to say oath. I always found this stage funny because it says, it says sneak into the town, but there's nothing sneaky about this at all. Oh, that's a bad, bad ass magic spell, isn't it? Yeah, there's one thing about this game I don't like, it's these little sh crappy little weapons that you ride on, the catapult and this thing here, it's just a little bit pointless, I don't know. Let's get that. Fire, breeze fire. Yes. Okay. Cheap boss, eh? It's going to be like that, is it? Yes, 
take that. Oh, see, he's no, that's just, you, you can't do anything about it. The, the, the game kind of cheats in that respect. It's kind of an un unblockable boss move, isn't it? Oh, I like this, how you can get food off the stalls in the market. That's quite cool. Oh, a potion, that'll do. A bit of food. I have to guess where it's going to appear. That's a bit cheeky. How am I supposed to... Oh, you're supposed to... Okay, hit it. Right, okay. Well, I've missed my chance now, haven't I? Oh, alright. Did I disturb your conversation, lads? I'm sorry. Is that Gilius Thunderhead riding him? I don't know. Definitely time for some magic there, I think. Look at that, I love that effect. Very Mortal Kombat fatality-esque, isn't it? Oh, this guy's got the electricity, okay. I need some health off that dude in the background there. He's gone. Magic. Oh, let's hit him while he's down. Lovely. And now do the magic. Oh no, I've got none. I've got no magic. Oh, come on, we've got him, surely. He's got me. So who's the best character in this so far? I don't know. For me, the girl. I think I, I did. I, I did better with the girl. Dora, is it? I can't walk with these things. I just have to stay in place. Let's free the slaves. never gets old. I love that magic. That's what Golden Axe is all around, all about. Oh, these guys are very familiar from the first game, aren't they? The twins. Okay, that's kind of unblockable. Oh, he's got me. Counter-attack. Electrocute him. There we go. Excellent. Oh, I've got no magic left. A magic would be perfect right now, but I think I'm on my last life. Oh no, we've got one more character left. Tricks. Oh yes. Let's go straight for the magic. I didn't know. I don't know what that did. Oh, do you know what I think that did? Actually, I think he doesn't have a magic ability. I think he just gives potions or something to people, right? He just conjures up potions and health, maybe. So he doesn't really do any damage. Ah oh, dear. So come on, he's gonna make up for that in some respect. Kind of move he's got he's quite quick. Oh that's a shame about his magic. Oh, 
Oh, just sorry, I've moved the camera there. Got a little bit excited. I'm completely surrounded here, I'm gonna have to systematically take these guys out very carefully. Did I just eat something? Is he a cannibal? Did I just eat a dead body or something? I ate something to sound like on the floor. Oh, okay. So I think I'm in a dark room and I think I can turn the light on in here. There's like a chain or something maybe? Or does the light come on in a second? Isn't that cool how like when you hit the bad guy, the, the clang of the steel kind of sparks the light, turns the light on. That's quite cool, I like that. Let's see this guy's magic again. Like, I don't have any magic. Alright, let's get away, get away, get away. See, there's one point with the enemies that, even in the original Golden Axe, that you can't block their attack. You can do some certain damage onto them, but then they're going to hit you, no matter what. I'll have to get free here. Come on, there we go. I always hated these things, they're like, so hard to get magic out of. Okay, next stage. Are we getting there now? We rescue all of the villagers, but some of them had been recaptured and taken to the castle of Death Adder. Right, so I think we're going to see some uh, bosses here. Which way should we go? I've been up there through... I want to go this way because I've not been this way before. Oh, wow, that's cool. I fell in the water. Do I have to jump on the boat there? I don't know what's going to go. Yeah. Okay. Let's go. Skeletons? Yeah, of course. Oh, certainly not as annoying as the... Oh, I've spoken too soon. Spoke way too soon there. Yeah, so see, his magic is like generating health. Which is kind of different, I guess, but I would rather destroy enemies with it. Whoa! I need that dragon. Yes, that is cool. Come here, you. Yes, give me your magic. Oh! Fires and trees and wood doesn't go together, so I should be able to burn these guys to a crisp. Oh, right, I've lost my dragon now. That was short-lived. It's kind of typical for me when I play these kind of games. Like, I get the good thing and then I lose it straight away. What are these guys doing? Let me get some health. I can't generate it. Damn it. Yeah, this is definitely the worst character for me. 
It's great that, yeah, he generates health when you press the magic button, but he never has any to generate, which is so annoying. You have to, like, collect a certain amount of potions. Yeah, so he's gone. I think we're nearly at the end. Let's go back to... Let's go back to Dora. She was down good. I have to yeah, she, she's got a lot more magic. She's got... I think she's got the highest in magic concentrate. Unless you have to collect them... Unless that means you have to collect more magic bottles. Does she use four at a time? So you can use her magic three times, maybe. That, maybe that's what that means. So now it would be good. Yeah, great. So she holds the most amount of magic points. Oh. boss time. Probably what boss I've already seen. Yeah, this electrocution dude, okay. Oh, he's down. Let's get him. Excellent. Now, this is going to be an unblockable move by him, I bet. You'll get to a certain point. There you go. He has to like. He has to take some of your energy off. It's just the way the game goes, isn't it? Better use some magic before I lose it. Yeah. Didn't actually take that much off him. Yeah, I suppose we're going to see a lot more little mini boss battles now before we actually get to Death Adder. What is that? Oh, she just ate it. Oh, that's gross. Drop on me, clearly. Lose it. Might as well. One more shot of magic. Use it up before you lose it. Oh, 
Oh, did pretty well against those skeletons until then. Let's keep going. Let's go with the original guy, Axe Battler, essentially. It's not Axe Battler himself, though, is it? It's another guy, but he's essentially the same kind of dude, right? Doesn't really, you'd think the magic potions would take a hell of a lot more energy off the bosses, so, but it does not, unfortunately. Good for clearing out lots of enemies. Oh, I've run out of magic already. Just got to take these guys. Oh, look. See, when you get surrounded like this. So he's only got one shot of magic and he uses them all at once. So for magic, Dora definitely is better. If I can get these skeletons out of the way, I don't know if they respawn. It'll just be him and me then. There we go. Come on, there's the unblockable hit that I can't do anything with. So, Death Adder, I think, now, at this point. So great music on the last stage at least, very epic. I'm gonna hang here for a... Oh, let's, let's keep going. If there was ever a place to use some magic, it was here. There we go. Oh! This guy. thing oh no oh to hear the crunch of that beast taking a nice bite out of the enemy that was cool oh there's some magic up there let's get some magic potion Oh, 
okay. So I guess you gotta take off the different sections of before you get to Death Adder now. This is actually quite a big game. I think it's a little bit longer than the original Golden Axe, like level-wise. Definitely more because it's got those branching paths as well. So with that replay value, there's more to see in the game. So they've definitely increased the game in respects to levels and replayability. That flying kick he does, I mean, I think his legs are a little bit long now, I don't like that. I mean, it's effective, but it just looks a bit weird. Falls over, faints. Oh, these guys again. All right, bit of magic. It doesn't take a lot of energy off, does it? It's not good to be in the middle of them, eh? Wow, I mean, the energy. Let's go with the girl. I love that. That's definitely for me, that's the best. That's the best spell in the game, that is. I love the electricity. She definitely just has, I think. Few more moves. She's got her stick, she's got her legs. Get over here and we'll use some magic on these guys. There we go. Sweet. So when playing Golden Axe, you can be very careful because when you're attacking one enemy, even in the original as well, it leaves you open from attack from behind. guys are taking a, a while to get rid of. There we go. Oh, it's this guy again. This guy keeps showing up. He's like a bad penny. I can't get on that little catapult thing, did I? I dissed them earlier saying they weren't really bad, but now I need it, right? Yeah, they're just background graphics. Okay, let's... Use some magic on this guy. We've got a bit of magic to use up. Got a couple of shots here, let's use it up. It's not taking as much damage off as a combo would. Like a basic. 
basic attack would take more energy off. Let's stick with Dora, she seems to be my favourite character for sure, I think. Yeah, getting nowhere near. I mean, this game is just huge. satisfying scooping up all that gold oh nice magic drop there we'll definitely use some of that let's get rid of these skeletons as quick as possible Hopefully they won't respawn. Let's use this magic up before we die. That's what it's there for. Free hit. Nice. And then a bit, bit of magic. There we go. Should be getting closer to the boss now. Here we go. This is the big boss, I think. I mean, that's just an awesome sprite, isn't it? Look at the... He just looks menacing. Now, I think the idea is to get rid of his shield, right? I think you can knock his shield away from him. I think. Oh, let's keep going. Dora. Oh no, that's it, right? Yeah, when you use your magic, he kind of sucks it with his, uh, he sucks it in his shield, so... The first part of him, you have to get rid of his shield, so then you can use your magic. Because he'll just eat it otherwise. So there goes his shield, and now you can start using your magic against him. Yeah, very well thought out boss battle. I mean, incredible game. And he's got the golden axe with him. But then I think he's got multiple forms as well, so... Free hit. There we go, let's use some magic now. That's a great counter. I don't think I can jump over that, can I? You probably could if you were quite skilled. Oh, okay, I get the idea. Stay close to him when he does his magic. Maybe it looks like it's kind of... You can get, get away from it. Alright, let's see what he does now. Surely that's not the end. Oh, I think, yeah, you kind of battle him again now at this point, don't you? When you're kind of flying away with your friends. You think it's the end, but it's not really, right? Here he comes. Here he comes. Here we go. There we go, let's use some magic to finish him. Big finish. Oh no, I'm still going. What's he doing? Oh 
Gilius Thunderhead appears as if from nowhere, strikes the final blow. Wow, that was epic. That's a great beat em up. That's a great little slog of a beat em up. It's a, it's a good. It's got a good amount of kind of. What was that? 45 minutes? That's a 45 minute run. So that's a perfect amount for a beat em up. And obviously, you can stick it on a much harder difficulty if you're so inclined. Great, great finish. So yeah, I mean, that's a playthrough of Golden Axe, The Revenge of Death Adder on the arcade.